hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel i'm super excited to be back on your screen and i'm not alone today like i know you can already see it. i'm surrounded by glory somebody say glory so yes i'm surrounded by glory i'm surrounded by two of my friends and i'm going to be having a very interesting discussion today so i don't want to waste your time at all so let them quickly introduce themselves themselves so let's start with you hi my name is john i just Zion. Zion and mm, I'm you've probably seen Wally before. Wally is a regular for myself. <laughs> All right, so guys, today we want to talk about career women and marriage. So I was having a discussion with him some time ago, and you know, it's an argument kind of ensued because why well, we we didn't seem to agree on certain things, and so I just really wanted to bring it here because I don't know how many people so think this way and I don't know the people that are thinking the way I'm thinking and to balance it I decided to bring one or let me be the balance so the two of them are going to be speaking on different perspectives now so what was the issue there seems to be a general notion or there seems to be a kind of notion that if you are a career woman and by career woman I mean that if you have a career if you have something you're doing whether you're a CEO or you're working in a place but like you are very diligent you are very intentional about um going up the ladder that there is usually issues with those kind of women and marriage because apparently they usually don't <laughs> so that's really what this discussion is about so i don't want to talk too much i want them to do most of the talking so who is going to break the ice who is that <laughs> so just tell us what you think about career women and the marriage what really is your take on it first of all i would like to say thank you god bless you first of all i would like to say but everything I will be saying today is not applicable to all career women. Okay. But I will say that 70% of career women that I've seen or that I know, or in one way or the other, we've had experiences together, are women who has had... By experience, you mean? Yeah, by experience. Are women who <laughs> <laughs> have had issues with their relationship or their marriage. Mm -hmm. Now, I'd like to say, career women tends to be arrogant. Mm. They tend to be domineering. Mm. They tend to see their husband as, you know, inferior to them. Mm. You understand? Now, <laughs> bro, hold on, no. Wale, hold on. I'm saying it's not applicable to all oh, career women. 70%? 70%. 70%. 70%. 70%. You know, you no, 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 no. I mean, I mean, see, marriage is a whole lot of responsibility. Mm -hmm. And it can only produce a result of testimony when the two parties are coming together to put hand in hand. Yes. And together mm -hmm. to work it out. To work it out. Woman Benson, and Bishop, and the marriage. You're saying what? I said a career man who puts hand in hand to the marriage. Since he says something to be sent and a testimony, blah, blah, blah. So that's what he's saying. All of them are not putting hand in the marriage. Like, they just, just do, do and just they enter and just arrogantly. Arrogant and live arrogantly again. You know, what I'm talking about now mm -hmm. is uh, also equivalent to relationship to, not just marriage alone. Now, you find out that so many career women in a relationship tends to have problem in that relationship. No problem. Why? No, what no what 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 problem? Problem of submission, respect. Ah. Wait, submission, respect. They always feel that domineering attitude, you understand, or domineering spirit. They always feel that finish it. They always I... feel like they are better. Can I ask you a question? Okay, are you talking on the point of view in your own time of relationship with those kind of people? I'm talking about general terms. General yeah, view. Generally. Because yes. I have issues with them what you are saying. Being, uh -huh. you are like, that's why I said that's that's why I said it's not all. Okay. Tell me, tell me, tell me why. Okay, you guys wait. Sure. Let's let's put context to this thing. Okay. <laughs> let's put context. So let me just explain. So what I think. Personally, I feel that the reason why you think that career women are proud or are arrogant is because you think that the only thing a man has to offer in a relationship is finances. I mean, there are so many other things. Lord. So if I'm making a lot of money myself, <laughs> which by the grace of God, <laughs> okay. Yeah, but my point is that if you if you think that money is the only thing you have to offer me, then 
definitely if you come to my life and then you see that i have like i have the money you yeah, feel intimidated yes. yeah, you, you have nothing to you offer. have nothing to offer but i feel like there's so much more a partner has yeah, to offer yeah, that yeah, money yeah. like so much more so why would you think that because a lady is making earning more money. or is making money or is very intentional about her career then it means that she lacks submission because to be fair you are not the only person who has said it like i've actually you, met quite a number of men she likes money exactly so much blah 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 every time money 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 but if she makes money but she makes money exactly she like she's not making money and then you're saying i don't want a liability okay okay pay. hold on um if I may, Personally, I don't have issues with women. In fact, personally, I would love a woman or I'm going to support my woman if she's making more than me. You understand? Now, I'm not talking in the context of my own, my own efforts, my own job or my own responsibility to my marriage. I'm talking generally. Now, I have come across men who complain Married men, I mean, married men who, in fact, some of them are old enough to be my elder, elder brother mm. who complains to me that and tells me that their wife doesn't have time for them. Oh, Don't bother, try, Lati. Sorry, I'm, I'm using you, but if he tries to, you know, ah, Mama, Alpha, you only you go to their business you meeting, to me. month, you know, even the children. Do you know that so many career women are they're always angry that they have children? Because no, the I don't think it should be so many. Let's say thirty percent. Some some career women are always angry that they have children because preventure they get married and then a child comes in. They feel that child is a burden to them. They want to focus. They want to get to the limelight, and it's not a problem for a woman. I love hardworking women, but when you are doing this, you have to balance it. You have to balance the spirituality. You have to balance the emotions. No. You have to balance the psychological uh, yes. aspect of it. I'm sorry. You, Your children. You are, you, are, you are diverting. I'm not diverting. No, you are saying you are saying they are um, disrespectful, arrogant, not submissive. Mm. Now you are saying that like, they should no, balance it. Like, are you supporting or I don't like? I don't. I'm telling you what has been going on. What goes on with career women in relationship or in marriage? Okay, let me ask you a question. Those who don't want to marry them, don't they know that she's a career mom before? That's what I want to say since, that since, since, since I think we should ask this question. Is there a place? Should we then say that there is a place of actually knowing the kind of person you want to marry? So I'm if for sure. instance, if you know that uh, this lady, and then maybe we should even start by defining in context. What what do you mean by career woman? Okay. You know, earlier before this, when I started talking, I said career women always or sometimes have issues in relationship slash marriage. So I'm not restricted to relationship, I'm relationship alone or marriage alone. Now, what I mean by career women is a woman who has gotten to the peak of business or a business a tycoon of a woman who is young and then is there rolling with different big big and um, business tycoons and, and you, you, know. you are not big as so a guy. Not, so what is she wear rolling at that time? But she's pushing towards it. Pushing towards it. And you know, and, and you know, and you know, pushing towards it takes so many sacrifices. Then, 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 since you know she's pushed towards this thing, I cannot cope with that. Then, why are you pushing towards minor or dating her? You know, I was saying, though, you are still taking me back. This thing is a relationship. So, are you saying that if I love a woman and she's a career woman, I can I, I cannot tell her that okay, I'm having issue with. You no, know, I don't time for no, me. You want to date this woman? I am. We are dating. Wait, before you dated this woman. Okay, he's saying least, that before you. Before date there are some things we first ask. Okay, that, fine. What do you what, not what's know your that plan? That. What like okay, but what what other will get to us to like? What's your next five, hope ten you know, years plan? I hope you know love is sacrifice. Then sacrifice yourself and have a career man. <laughs> See, no, no, no. So, no, no. you are saying that. No, wait, wait. You are saying that. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait. Calm down. Calm down. Yeah, now, see what you want. She's all like me, me feeling right now. You know, she's a pure career woman. Okay. What makes you think I'm a pure career woman? That fact. I know. They're not saying you want to. I know. You want, you want to get that. You're not like, okay, fine. Ah, if you. This is this, 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 this. No matter what you say, she just say, take it or leave it. Now you're not like when she's at this stage, Nayana, because she's dating and you're feeling 
because she's not giving you time. Yeah, you know this thing before you enter it. So if I don't sacrifice, okay, fine. Okay, oh babe, you are what's up? You are busy on twenty twenty five. Look at this ready for this week. Maybe create time for me. Okay. You know what? Let, I let, like, let's, I let's, like let's... your point. Now, I'm sorry I have to say this. Okay. I'm not supposed to say this, but okay. I was with I was in a relationship some times ago. Mm -hmm. And um <laughs> it's so funny. This person will tell you she's busy. As in loving is person in the same country and same state. Allow me to talk now. No, before you wait. No, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm going there. I, guys together, like, I, I'm, going I there. Guys the I'm going there. I'm going there. I'm going there. there. Allow me to talk. This person, you know, one thing about me is I will not go into a relationship without knowing somebody. We've been friends. Now, when she left the country, she started complaining of being busy. When she was in Nigeria, she complains that, but mm -hmm. yes, she complains. I know you very it's well. my story now. I know, I, 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 she complains that, that but but it it was it was we were able to manage it. At in at least in a week. How many times this? At least they see more than three times in a week to four. Back to back, like late hours. So now tell me. This is even my feeling. story. Yeah, I love you. That's it four times. Now, okay, it, okay, baby. okay. Now, she left the country. Okay. And then, I understand because I have people aside her there who tells me how busy they are. But these same people, mm. even including married people who has a child, husband, sisters, family to attend to over there. Yeah. We and still quit time to work, talk. Yeah. Now you say you are busy. The next thing I see, you are posting your friends. That's a career woman. She is a career woman. Yeah, no, yeah. I, that's, that's the thing. I don't think like I think we have a general notion that career women general, and I, I don't think we put career women in the right context. So the okay. fact that a lady is chasing her career and wants to be better or wants to be one of Doesn't the best in a her career woman. game does not mean that she has to fall into that category of being proud or be you might not be a career woman and still claim to be busy honestly okay should we not use the word career women so what words do you want us to use? no let's should we use busy women no, because no, i don't no, understand no, this. No, no, this is no, no, this is the, the career woman is the, because i feel that you think that when a lady is a career woman then she has issues with submission is, let me know if I'm, I'm right yes you feel that if a lady is a career woman she has issues and with submission. career women who are the top who has gotten yes, there? Yes, you feel like they have issues with submission. They yes. have issues. They are arrogant, right? Am I domineering? And domineering. Thank you. Do you agree with him? Like, like, we said something before saying this thing when we were in church. We said, okay, someone at the peak and went to and they're saying, why, why would your man submit to someone who is, who is, who is less? Like, you don't feel me. We're having a conversation right now. Are you joking? Like, not wait, are you intelligent. Wait, wait, are you me, saying submission wait, to, to be as a result of your level? Yes, level of level of financial level of Let me land. Let me land now. I'm not seeing your finances. She she saw who you are before she married you. Mm -hmm. But guy, she's so a career woman. The she's a career woman. Then guy, you need to look if I look if I need a career woman and you need that to submit it hundred. It's not about you giving that money. No much does your money. She she gives you money, but in terms of okay, fine. Let's talk. Let's let's work things out. You are like you are absolutely on a zero. Like you can you can't be comfortable with that. You can't like create social. Comfort means not, conversation. I, I'm not I'm not talking about those kind of men. We have we have carpenters or furnitures who are sound, who can keep their homes. Is it about keeping it's not about, I think he, he's saying that, and I think it boils down. What are they saying? Actually, boils down to what I'm saying. That I feel like there's so much more to a relationship it's, than it's money. It's, it's, it's so if you I'm not even talking about money yet. Yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah, what? Yeah, what do you think makes a woman submissive. not submit to a man? Lot of things. You, you said like, career no, woman. Career now, woman. Now, what do I? What do I mean? Right. Okay. So what makes a career woman? A career woman obviously has money. Probably. I'm not but more than I'm, I'm not even talking. It might not even be more than. There are so many. There are so many rich. There are so many. There are so many rich. There are so many wealthy men, coded, silent wealthy men. You understand? Who are more wealthy than their wife? But yet their wife is more busier than they than they are. Yeah. Now, 
I'm talking about responsibility as a career woman. Your responsibility to your husband, to your children, to your relationship, to your what courtship. Kind of, what kind of relationship and responsibility does a woman have to her boyfriend or fiance? No, no, I say no. Husband, no. No, let's even leave yeah. us back. Relationship. You know, you know there's, a limit to we're can, about there's a limit to what we can say about marriage because three of us, we are not yet married. It does right. So uh -huh. let's do relationship. So relationship. What relationship. responsibility uh, does a lady have to a fiance when she's in a relationship uh, that involves uh, submission? That's where you're going to. There's, 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 there's this saying. There's this saying that. Oh, shout it for me, silly. Uh -huh. Wait, True. Wait, be more True. So there is a limit to what you can tell me and I can listen. True. Now, uh, there is a party going on in my house this weekend. I want you to come around. Mm -hmm. She will tell you she's busy. A woman who does not have time for family, her husband's family, how are you sure she's going to have time for the children when she gets married? One. Mm -hmm. Okay, you admit, okay, she's a very busy person. Are you saying... There is no, there is no moment, there is no time, there is no a day, or there is no week you can spare to okay. attend to a husband to be. Okay. Mm -hmm. To be fair, I agree with you on that, and I, I have a saying or I have a notion that you always make time for things that are important to you. You create time for somebody you, you love. You will bring that mountain for I someone you love. Well, okay, I want to say something, but we are talking. No matter how, no matter how. A career man is a busy man is bro. He should keep building for you, should keep it for you if you want it. That, that's what I'm saying. Like, see, I feel like you, you what, what? If, if personally knows me, oh, 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 my mom can oh, call me or himself oh, can call me. Oh. I may not be doing anything, I mean, just look at phone and just swipe. He knows oh. when I just look if I was this time, I'll give you. Like, do you actually okay? My boyfriend, but okay, fine. Do you want it that particular time, that particular moment? You want me to come for your family? That's another thing. We shake it for your boyfriend. Obviously, ah. how, how, how are you going to be in a relationship that you are not worth sacrificing for? Yeah, why should you be in that kind of relationship? Most people don't want it. Okay, wait, wait. Let, let me let's not let's let not wait, forget. Let's, let's not forget the aspect wait. of character, too. Let me let, let me let's not forget the aspect of please. character for wait, women. Wait, from wait, 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 women. wait, let me talk calm that down, down, calm down. What I want to, now, I have a question. Please answer as I am answer. Mm -hmm. Do you think it's possible for a woman not to be a career woman and mm -hmm. still claim to be too busy for a man? Yes, it's possible. So what makes you now think that the fact that a woman claims to be busy, to be arrogant, is automatically like because she is a career woman? You know what it? That's what I said. It still boils down. It can still be brought down, or we should still consider. Down, yeah. We should still consider character too. Okay, what character are you talking about? Obinjo baniwa oniwa. Obinjo baniwa oniwa means a so, woman that does not have character. Does not have character. Does not have character. Eh? So. Does that, that mean that, that a career woman does not have character? I'm not saying in all of these men does not have photo. <sighs> there are three things, three major things that I know mm -hmm. can keep your relationship going. Okay, let us, yeah. wait. So you tell us the three things. So guys, we have to stop here. We're going to continue next week from here. Stay tuned. And if you have not subscribed to my channel, <laughs> if you have not subscribed, please tell them to subscribe. If you never subscribe, I get you. <laughs> if I catch you, <laughs> so subscribe, people. So please subscribe, subscribe. to my channel. We'll continue from here next week. And please comment. Mwah.